Hey, thanks for checking out Nuts and Bolts with Tone. Today I'm going to talk about a problem I had with this Duramax water pump. So coming down here to this pipe that comes out of the top of the water pump, there's an O-ring right there. And that just sits in a little channel. Just put a little bit of lube, Silglide, grease, whatever you got. Comes up here, do a little rubber hose right there. And then it comes up here to the thermostat, underneath the thermostat housing, right there. So this O-ring that's inside this pipe right here, okay, I had an issue with this leaking. I left this rubber hose attached to the pipe and I tried to put the hose on and slip this pipe into the thermostat housing. So my first time I did it, the O-ring tore a little bit. Then I had to pull it off, did it again, thought maybe I didn't lube it up enough, then I put extra grease, and then the O-ring tore. So what I did for the third time was I took this hose and I disconnected, uh, loosened up both hose clamps, and I slid this rubber hose all the way over on this pipe as far as it would go. And then I was able to turn this pipe and get the O-ring in solid, and then as I rotated it around, I slid the rubber hose on, and then when you put it down here, just make sure your O-ring has not come out of this groove. And then when you're done, pressure test it to make sure it doesn't leak. So now we're all good. Got it all sealed up. That's my ad addendum to the water pump repair on the Duramax. Thanks for checking out Nuts and Bolts with Tone. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Let me know your trials and tribulations with this Duramax water pump. And check out my Instagram at Nuts and Bolts with Tone. See you next time.